So this is a very incredibly useful paper that was published by Zachary Munn and colleagues. And they noted in their paper why scoping reviews are useful. So they are useful as a precursor to a systematic review. So sometimes we just want to know a snapshot of the literature that's been conducted out there on a topic. And then later on, we're going to use this to inform the conduct of a more concise and a more, um, when, we're, when we're thinking about a systematic review, the research question is generally more focused than the scoping review. So the scoping review is a lot broader. So we would do this broad review and then this would help identify areas for a more focused systematic review. Um, it could also help us to identify different types of available evidence on a topic or analyze different knowledge gaps clarify key concepts or definitions, examine how research has been conducted on a topic, as well as key characteristics or factors related to a particular concept or topic. 